So, in this video, we're going to show you how to... Oh my god, his eyes are popping out of his face! Oh, that's just gross, disgusting! These awesome, ooey-gooey, glossy eyeballs. You will need a ping-pong ball. And some blue tack to keep the eye in place while you create the gore. For the perfect iris, use a one pence piece or other small coins like a dime. A word of warning, my jokes are going to get cornier and cornier. You get it? Ugh. So, draw around the coin. We are using acrylic water-based paints for this. Start by carefully painting your iris in the chosen colour. We've opted for green, but you can always go for blue or grey or even brown eyes. We googled eyes when creating this, which will give you some fantastic imagery that will aid you in painting your eyeball. You'll need to add a darker colour for your pupil, and don't forget to give it some highlights for a more realistic look. Now to get gnarly. Use a fine brush and red paint to create the veins. Remember, these are thicker towards the back of the eye and should branch off towards the iris. For best results, try to ensure that no two veins are the same. Now, using a wooden cocktail stick or toothpick, push through the back of the ping pong ball. This not only makes it easier when it comes to painting, but it helps us create our optic nerve. Use the glue gun to secure your cocktail stick, then drip and drag the glue all around the top of the eyeball. This doesn't have to be perfect at all, just make sure there are lots of different levels of glue. Now more veins. We actually use thread here from a local DIY store, however you could use single thread cotton. Apply PVA to the eyeball and then get your single thread of cotton and gently place it onto the ping pong ball, moving around, gluing down, creating the shape of your desired vein. Voila! There you have it, a sight for sore eyes. Now to get all bloody and gross, start painting all the glue drips with the red paint. And more red paint. Once the paint is dry, it's time to dip that eye. Here we are using standard gloss varnish. For best results and ultra gloss finish, we recommend enamel varnish. We stuck ours upright in some air drying clay overnight. And there you have it, creepy vein bulging eyes from hell. So, we hope you enjoyed our amazing video tutorial. Don't forget to subscribe and hit us up on our social media pages. Till next time guys, bye for now!